Tonight, we're talking with a man who filled out a food illness report form with the County of San Diego. Now, the health department says he's one of 11 people who contracted norovirus from a seafood buffet in Mission Valley. Brandon Hirsch is walking around fine now, maybe a little slimmer. He's down about 10 pounds after a rather rough Easter Sunday. Extreme nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, joint pain, muscle weakness. Um, and dehydration. The day before, Hirsch had eaten with a group of 11 at the 100 Seafood Grill Buffet. He was feeling so violently ill afterward, he went to the emergency room. I was just so dehydrated, I couldn't really swallow my own saliva. It felt like swallowing sandpaper. Um, it was difficult to speak any louder than a whisper. After his short hospital stay on Easter, he reached out to the health department to let them know he thought he was food poisoned. Four others in his group felt the same way, the people who ate oysters that night. The people who had one seemed to be pretty fine. Anyone who ate more than two were, was, was out of commission. The CDC says oysters contaminated with norovirus can cause illness if they're raw, which these were. This is not the first oyster-related norovirus outbreak this year. The health department says more than 40 people got sick from raw oysters in Pacific Beach in January. Those were from Mexico. The health department believes these are previously frozen oysters from South Korea. We called the restaurant today to learn more, but they didn't pick up the phone. I eat out regularly, and so um, I was not expecting. Um, I was just expecting it to be as safe as food I normally eat, I guess. Hirsch says he probably won't eat at the restaurant again, but he doesn't blame them for what happened. I don't really have malice toward the restaurant or anything. The county says it's working with the state health department to help identify other potential retailers of the oysters. Reporting at the county administration building, Spencer Soicher, ABC 10 News.